Hey guys, it's DC here and today I want to talk to you about are you too old to get into cybersecurity? So this is something that gets asked quite a lot, which is am I too old to get into cybersecurity? I'm, you know, 35, I'm 40, I'm 50 years old. Is it too late for me to get into the industry? Which I'm I'm going to start off with that cybersecurity is not like a labor intensive job, right? So it doesn't mean your your body is not going to pack it in, right? You're not going to lose your back uh, typing really hard on a keyboard. It's all about the mental stamina that you have to get through each day. Now, for example, if sitting at a computer for eight to nine hours a day and punching out uh, different vulnerability scans and you know, reading through different logs and configuring different systems is going to be too tiring for you to do five days a week. Well, then, hey, maybe uh, cybersecurity isn't for you. Saying that, though, there are a lot of jobs out there that are very similar in the way that they work, where you are sitting at a computer doing something, whatever it is, for a period of eight to nine hours a day. It's really no different to that. If you want to do a job that's in an office and has a good pay, and pretty good teams usually, and you know, pretty quirky uh, guys and girls in the teams, which is always a little bit of fun, then cybersecurity is definitely for you. As a career, it's quite rewarding and quite diverse as well. So it's not all blue team, red team. There is a whole bunch of purple stuff in between, which is sort of like you do a pen test, for example, and then the customer says, okay, we want you to then fix it. Well, you're doing both then the attack and the defense for that particular system, which is pretty cool. In most cases uh, within the IT industry as a whole, you're usually uh, at other ends of the spectrum. So it's more like you're a sysadmin or you're a developer or you know something along those lines where it's very uh, stable on exactly what you're doing. The good thing about cybersecurity is that it's it's so broad. Now, I don't need to make yet another video on trying to get people excited about the industry because I think I've done that enough. But it, it, it really is a rewarding career and I really don't believe in there being an age bracket to get into the industry. As long as you have the drive, the right sort of personality for the job and for the teams that you're going to work in, and the skill, of course, then you will be absolutely fine getting into most organizations or uh, government agencies. Now, for like, uh, I guess like a, a range of how old people are that I have worked with, I've worked with people who were mid 20s all the way up to late 60s, to be honest, and across all, all types of different jobs. So it's not just like, the younger guys are right down at the, the very entry level, although in most cases they are. There are a lot of guys who are 50 years old who have just gotten into the industry and that's where they're starting off and that's perfectly fine. A good example of this is actually ex-military guys who have gone through organizations like With You With Me, which is like an ex-veteran organization that helps skilled people with negative vetting already to then get into cybersecurity roles. And that's that's a really good way to go about it as well. Definitely check out With You, With Me Academy and tell them I sent you there because I know those guys. And they're then sort of just going in with that security mindset already. They've already got that understanding of defense and they go straight into government jobs. And it's, it's pretty cool, I think. Like to be able to go from a military job where you're either like a, a builder or a plumber or whatever it was, maybe just a, a grunt in the army or whatever defense force job it was. You've then got that experience and that right sort of mindset that they look for, for someone who is very strict and process driven. And then you're gonna take that and go into a cybersecurity role and you'll just smash it. You'll fit right in real quick. It's the people that they get a little bit worried about who are a little bit more adventurous with their ideas of uh, law enforcement and I guess, procedures that they, they don't really like. So if you do come across as a bit of a character, um, you have a less chance there, but that's that's another story for another time. I don't wanna get into different personality characteristics this time. I will touch on though quickly that different personalities are definitely suited to different types of jobs within cybersecurity. Uh, for example, my own history in cybersecurity, especially in government organizations, was far less technical than you might think. It was more of a hands-on, uh, in the field type role. So anyway, back to the point, are you too old to get into cybersecurity? 
Fuck no. Just go for the job. If you like it, enjoy it. If you don't like it, do something else. It's not the end of the world. It's 2020. You can do whatever the fuck you want. But yeah, that's, uh, that's all I have for this quick video. Uh, if you do like these sort of videos, please do like, comment below if you have any questions, subscribe for more, and I'll see you all in the next one. Catch you later. Do you think I want this?